Hello everyone, welcome to the 20th episode of Weekly Flyby. I am Sergio from Helisimmer.com and I will be taking you through the news that were published on the website during the last week. Frank Dainese and Fabio Bellini helped us start the week with an announcement for the release date of their most recent scenery for X-Plane, Mont Blanc Group. The scenery will be released on November 22nd and the duo has sent us a copy to preview, which we did, and we can find it published on our website already. Frank and Fabio have already got us used to their quality and craftsmanship, and their work is no longer a surprise. We can count on a job well done and amazing areas to fly at, especially for the helicopter pilots. Check the preview out, and honestly, grab this scenery as soon as it comes out. VSK Labs recently updated a batch of their aircraft in order to keep them working properly in X-Plane 11.40. With all the changes in the experimental flight model, a few glitches and issues started to pop up on aircraft that made use of it, and VSK Labs managed to take care of a lot of their fleet already. The updated aircraft include their helicopters. Both the Cabri G2 and the Revolution Mini 500 are now fully compatible with the latest version of X-Plane. Virtual reality is nothing new for our community for some time, and we see an increase of the use of the technology in pretty much all the sims out there. Nonetheless, it seems our hobby is not getting enough attention from the hardware manufacturers that keep focusing on other genres when, in fact, flight simulation and especially helicopter flight simulation really pushes the boundaries of VR and explores its full potential. I have written a small article about this, mentioning all the reasons why I personally consider helicopter flight simulation to be the epitome of VR use. Perhaps if we can get the attention of manufacturers, we can get them to develop other solutions for us, such as newer or better ways to interact with the cockpit, for example. Give the article a read, and if you agree with me, please share the word. The more exposure we get, the better are our chances to be heard by the companies that are leading the VR revolution. Seracim has been away for some time, but they recently surprised us with a screenshot for an upcoming project, the MI-17. There's no more information about it, which we are guessing it's being developed for P3D. We are trying to reach Seracim, but we have had no luck so far. Verpal Controls was having a competition in which the community could submit designs for several categories, such as jet aircraft, piston aircraft, spacecraft, and helicopters. The winner for each category is going to be developed by the company, and some prizes were awarded to the designers. Something that really raised my eyebrows was the fact that Verpal had a special prize for the single most voted project overall. So, from all the designs that were submitted, Verpil awarded a special prize to the one that had the most votes, and that design was the helicopter one. This is a loud and clear sign that our community is not only in need of dedicated hardware, but also that we are speaking up more, more open to asking the developers and manufacturers for products, and also that we are growing in numbers and uniting. It's just great to see manufacturers wishing to enter our market and our community responding accordingly. Hopefully, this is just the beginning, and we will see more products from Verpal and other manufacturers coming out for helicopters. Orbex has released yet another product for their True Earth line. This time, the company released the first of two parts that will comprise the whole California state. Orbex True Earth US Northern California continues the region below Oregon, and extends all the way down to the Fresno, Monterey, and Big Sur area. Check out our article for the link to purchase it. And there we go, that was all for this week. I'd like to thank you once again for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the little bell to get the notifications every time we have a new video out. I would also like to remind you that you can support us on Patreon. Visit our Patreon page at patreon.com forward slash alicimmer and learn more. Until next week, take care and fly safe.